G'day friends, welcome back to Bush Rats, and today you're outside in Young Lee's outdoor kitchen. We're down by the dam, uh, for the last month or so it's been marron season, so we've been getting out, chasing the black crabs, here's one right here for you. They're a freshwater crayfish, and today we're going to do one of our favourite recipes, just a nice, simple, easy garlic butter marron. The march flies are out in full force, so there's going to be a bit of slapping, a bit of swearing going on. There's also a fire band, so we're going to do it on the old barbecue. Uh, but enough chit chat, let's get this thing underway. <laughs> So not many of you will know this, but I'm actually a qualified chef. So straight out of school, I went in and did a chef's apprenticeship. Used to work at a seafood restaurant and also at a resort, uh, doing a lot of weddings and that. So I know a few recipes here and there. So first thing you want to do with your marron is you're going to want to cut them in half. So we've got a nice big knife here. We're going to split these guys just down the middle, give them a wash and get them prepped up to go on the barbie. So we've got the marron all prepped up. I'm just going to pop that aside for the minute, give the chopping board a bit of a wash off, and we're going to fire up the barbecue. Once you've got your barbecue fired up, we're just going to give that five minutes to sort of heat up, get it nice and red hot. Now we're just going with a bit of salted butter, any butter will do, nice and soft. We're going to spread that onto the marron. In the meantime, we're going to chop up some garlic, which I've grown down to the Bush Rats Ranch. A little bit of chilli as well we've got down there. Um, so if you follow us on Instagram, you would have seen a little bit about the Bush Rats Ranch, um, but there's gonna be a few episodes coming up. We've been doing a few things down there. A nice big veggie patch, got the dam cranking. And with all that said, let's chop up some of this garlic. Now depending how much garlic you're into, I'm gonna go for about three or four cloves for these three marron. Look at that, nice and big, homegrown. Can't beat it. Chili and garlic's all chopped up. Got the marron split in half. It's time to get these things on the grill. So I've got a little bit of butter here. I'm just gonna give that a bit of a spread over each marron. A little sprinkle of garlic and chili, and we'll get them straight in. Ooh, that's red hot. Chili and garlic are on, so a little bit of salt and a little bit of pepper. Let's get these things on the grill. So we're going to give them about five minutes either side, give them a flip, check them out a bit, have a bit of a tidy up, and get ready to uh, show you guys what these are looking like and how they taste. Alright, so they've been on for about five minutes now. Give them a little bit of a flip. There we go. Got that nice bit of browning action happening to them. Turn them all over. Give them about another five minutes. And there we go guys, garlic marron, cooked to perfection on the grill. I've put a little bit of green shit just behind it there, just for aesthetics. Um, come back around the other side of the table here. So we might as well just get stuck into one here. Just gonna pull the body out of the tail. Less than 24 hours old, these ones here. Look at that, nice and brown. Now spot on, just the right amount of salt, a little bit of chili, plenty of garlic. You make a nice sandwich with these, they're good on steaks, do like a reef and beef sort of thing. Try this homegrown lettuce as well. Mmm, 
Well, that's it for this one, guys. I'm gonna get stuck into these. Uh, if you like this kind of thing, like and subscribe. Check out our other videos. We've got plenty of fishing, marining, camping. Uh, young Lee's gonna get back out there into the kitchen a lot more often now as well. Uh, starting to cool down. We've got fire season to look forward to. So a lot of pit fire, cooking on the grills. Until next time, we'll see you out there on the tracks. Yeah.